peristaltic pump is one of the best to use for low flow sampling. Uh, this particular pump is capable of lifting water from as deep as about 10 meters uh, and it's got a maximum flow rate of about 2 liters a minute but also a very very low um, uh, flow rate capability as well. So uh, just looking at the, the limit therefore, so this is ostensibly uh, a vacuum pump and therefore it can only really lift water from as um, uh, deep as 10 meters. So uh, what that means is so where the pump is sitting on the surface of the, um, uh, of the ground, uh, this distance here cannot be more than 10 meters. Okay, and that is the lift of uh, the pump. Now, that doesn't mean to say that you can't lower the tubing any further. So, um, the limitation as far as tubing is concerned is only, only how much tubing you have. This can go down for essentially hundreds of meters if you want to. We've had customers sampling typically at 150 or 200 meters um, uh, below ground level, uh, just provided that that lift that head there is less than 10 meters. Uh, the other really useful thing about this pump is because it has no uh, mechanical parts it is very tolerant to sediment any heavy sediment loads within the water just get pushed through and pushed past here. One more thing to be aware of uh, is the potential loss for VOCs, volatile organic compounds. Um, so again being a vacuum pump and being on a limit here uh, what's actually happening when you have a, uh, a lot of lift where at 10, 10 or more meters, uh, the water is essentially boiling off uh, under the uh, vacuum. Uh, and of course the VOCs will boil off faster than uh, the water itself. Uh, so you have potential loss of VOCs when the uh, lift gets higher, um, uh, but those losses uh, are, uh, uh, can be acceptable and can be quantifiable. Um, uh, the alternative uh, to this pump may be a bladder pump, but it's much harder to use and therefore much less repeatable. This is a very easy pump to use, it's easy to set up, and so if you can uh, accept that there will be some losses of VOCs in your sample, uh, you may get more repeatable results as a res uh, in the long term.